Hey guys, hope you're well, hope you're keeping safe. Welcome to the latest vlog. Uh, to follow one with the hashtag, our voices are not on lockdown. Over the next couple of days, we're going to be unpacking and discussing um, sexual and reproductive health and rights and how they've been affected with um, the, the, the COVID-19 pandemic. Um, to unpack it, uh, when, I'm, when we're talking about our, our sexual health, we're talking about our state of our physical, mental, and social well-being uh, in relation to, to our sexuality. When we're talking about our, our reproductive health, we're talking about um, a state of our mental, physical, and social well-being in relation to our reproductive system. Now, when I refer to, to, to sexual rights, we're talking about the rights that any individual or human being has over their body, autonomy over the body and over their sexuality, and of course, living free of any form of discrimination um, and, any form of, and, and against any form of threat or violence against them. And then our reproductive rights includes the right that an individual or human has over the choice of their reproductive health. And this, can inc this includes uh, the right to family planning, the right to, to safe abortion or termination of pregnancy, the right to take contraceptives, the right to, to providing sex education in our public schools, and of course the right to receive reproductive health services from, from our institutions. And what we're going to do is next week, I'm going to be moderating two separate panels set up by SADC Gender Protocol of Alliance in partnership with Gender Links, which is an NGO based in, in South Africa. And we plan to unpack what our sexual and reproductive health and rights are, and of course, how it's been affected by, by COVID-19. Uh, I will be speaking to, 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 to various esteemed uh, speakers who represent um, all forms of life, and we want to keep it as inclusive of, as possible. So it will be definitely be people from the LGBTQI movements. Uh, we, uh, we will have radical feminists on the ground, people representing HIV, people representing government organizations, global organizations. And the aim is to obviously unpack what our sexual and reproductive health and rights are how it's been impacted by COVID and what the solutions are, because we always need to find solutions to these crises, and, and to see what past policies are in place and what policies need to change. Remember, a lot of, a lot of countries and a lot of um, uh, communities have wonderful constitution and policies on the ground, but, and, but, in, in, and, but in reality, they don't really work. And also, they aren't inclusive of everybody within different communities. So if you'd like to join in the conversation or hear or learn or understand or see if you could add your expertise and to take this conversation even further, please just send an email to that's at the end of this vlog. Uh, if you want to join in, of course, also send an email. We will then obviously have to vet every email that comes through and then you will be sent a link to, to the meeting. And yeah, we need to keep this conversation going because these issues affect everybody in society and of course as we know with COVID-19 having been impacted by everybody um, this conversation is very very important so please join us next week Monday and Tuesday respectively uh, the time will be 11 a.m South African Standard Time and we aim to finish it about just after noon that is Monday the 11th of May and Tuesday the 12th of May uh, any more information, please just uh, send an email to the email at the end of this vlog. And remember, our voices are not on lockdown. See you then.